In this video, we were looking at how can we use the Excel to generate the plot to test assumption 4. The residual is normally distributed a random variable. So in order to test this assumption, please look at 3.4. So we're going to generate the normal probability plot and examine assumption 4 is as assumption 4 violated for the example I'm showing you in the slide in the Excel. So let's go back to look at my Excel again. So first, after you generate Excel output, you're going to see the three different types of the plot, as I mentioned in the first video. So the first is residual plot, the second is line feed plot, and the third is my normal probability plot. So this is the normal probability plot generated from the Excel, so which means you don't need to create this plot. So first, now before I move on to analyzing this plot, I want to emphasize again how, why the, which option you need to choose in order to generate this plot. So let's go back to the, my regression data set. So we have the GPA is my y variable, x1, x2, x4 is my predictors. So x1 is h, x2 to x4 is my dummy variable or indicator variable for class standing. So first after you choose data, data analysis, and find the regression, and click OK. So in this area, I want you to pay attention on the residual area. So on the residual area, we have the residuals, residual plot, line field plot, standard residual. So the last box, if you pay attention to look at the name, called the normal probability plot. So in order to generate the my normal probability plot using CM, you need to make sure you check this box when you do the regression analysis. So uh, that is how you get that plot. So let's go back to look at my result. So this is my normal probability plot. And we want to see certain pattern in order to define, to make a decision if the normality assumption is violated or not. So if you look at the slides, you found, so the assumption four, if the assumption four, the residual is normally distributed random variable is not violated, you should see the points should form approximately along a straight line. So if you go back to look at this Excel output, so what we are looking for is if this dot are uh, for along a straight line. So if you look at that, so you definitely allow a certain amount of tiny variation. So actually this uh, seven dots actually look like laying, uh, uh, following a straight line. So based on this plot, we get a conclusion, the assumption four, the residuals normally distributed random variable is not violated because they look like a straight line.